Next to Skate, representing Japan, Haru Takeuchi! And now to another Japanese competitor, Haru Takeuchi. He explained to me that he was injured late to June and thus doesn't have as much technical difficulty as he would like, but happy to be here. This is the first event since the Junior World Championships for Haru Takuyuki. And he explained that he was sad that he couldn't, through injury, jump triple axel. But that's a great example of how quality of both grades of execution of the technical score and the skating skills quality will sufficiently keep him in contention, I think. Uh, for all those, for those young skaters out there watching this, watch his back as we go through the replays, how strong his back is on the landings keeping his body alignment right on top of the ball of the foot. So there's a lot of flow on them. It's just beautiful quality, not only for the jumps, of course, all the way through the program. Posture so critical to so many aspects of our sport. You see the double axle here. Look at that back, nice and straight and strong. Mm. Flowing edge, as we see that here in the triple flip, the back is straight. Soft knees, strong back, strong arms. And if you can get that back straight like that, it's gonna save so many jumps when they go off kilter a little bit. And it's gonna add so much quality overall as well. Here's some of the steps of Mark. Yeah, and it, even here, look at that. Left forward inside edge with such classy posture and such commitment to the extension as well. And quite a lot often the Japanese men have a lot of speed, flow, and strength, but not always the finesse of line. And I think Haru Kakiuchi certainly has yeah. an awareness of it. He works, obviously, a great coaching staff, but choreographer 
listed as Stefan Lombier as one of his choreographers, and you can see the influence of those kind of artists on this skater. Yeah, well, actually, in saying that, Teddy, it explained to me that he was participated in the All Japan Junior Training Camp this summer, and he had a lesson with Daisuke Takahashi, and something that he'd hoped for and described as a dream. And I mean, that's wonderful that he's getting the access to somebody like 2010 World Champion Daisuke Takahashi. But also, you can see that kind of if, if that's a dreamlike situation for him, you can. It doesn't. It makes sense when you see the way he skates. That he likes somebody like that. Well, when you are. Where you grow up watching skaters like that and then skating with skaters mm. like that, um, you can't help but learn the good basics. And uh, mm. this young man has wonderful qualities and everything, as all the Japanese skaters do, but certainly from an elegance perspective and a body core perspective, strength, he has it all. And I'm sure the triple axle won't mm. be very far behind as he progresses through the rest of the season. 60.39 or 69.39 is his personal best, and he has a personal best. 69.99 without the triple axle. That's awesome, and he is thrilled.